Good enough. So, Michael, welcome. Thank you for joining us today. And, Thank uh, you, Michael. Yeah, we're curious to hear, you know, your, why you're supporting AB 138. Well, you know, I've been working on these issues for a long time about the public health uh, consequences of our food system and how we might uh, use food and beverages to make ourselves healthier. Uh, and one of the most effective strategies we've seen, and this is all around the world, not just the United States, uh, in recent years has been uh, the use of uh, taxing sugary beverages uh, and using the proceeds to advance public health. Uh, and that strategy has worked. Uh, it's working in Mexico right now. It's working in Berkeley, where I live, uh, and several other jurisdictions around the country. Um, the, the beauty of it is it's a win-win, um, that you are reducing soda consumption, and we've seen that happen uh, by around 10% in, in many of the jurisdictions that have tried it. And as people get off soda, by the way, they're drinking more water, um, which is what we should all be drinking more of. Okay. And, um, and at the same time that you're, you're discouraging soda consumption, you are um, providing funds for the really important public health work we need to do around education, around making healthier food available to people. Um, so here we have a, a very good strategy. Um, and I, I don't think people realize, too, just what uh, a contribution soda and other sugary beverages are making to the public health crisis. Um, that the epidemic of type 2 diabetes and obesity uh, owes to many factors, but, but sugary beverages are really high among them. And if you want to do one thing to uh, cut diabetes rates, which are bankrupting healthcare systems all over the world, uh, it's, it's lower soda consumption. Uh, it's that simple. Uh, so here we have an opportunity. And in the way that California likes to, to, uh, to lead and, and um, be a laboratory for democracy, this is an attempt, this is an opportunity to put a very progressive um, uh, idea out there and show that you really can tackle these issues, that you can lower uh, the you know type 2 diabetes and obesity and make some real improvements to the food system uh, with this single act great well thanks a lot really appreciate your your thoughts and your wisdom on this and uh, we look forward to talking with you again someday keep me posted all right we'll do bye bye good let me know what happens <laughs>